Well, hello everyone, Dylan here with my first LEGO Harry Potter review for 2024, and this one's on the Hogwarts Castle uh, Boathouse that is now being released. <clears throat> so on the front of the box here, I have the LEGO Harry Potter logos, Wizarding World logo, and same border that we've been seeing since mid-2021, and also picture of the whole set going on in there, and Age recommendation is 8 and up. Set number 76426 has 350 pieces and all the minifigs included. And models do not float, of course. And then on the back side of the box, so which have another view of the set and also the one feature of it and collectible portraits, one random tile included. Just like the uh, Wizarding World uh, card tiles that went on since 2021 through 23, which we all see in this set. But yeah. And that's about it with the box here. And now onto the manual, which different rendering than the uh, front of the box. And on rendering that has been going on since 2022. And then Add for the builder app and change over to paper bags. And then on the back, how to win on the online survey. All the pieces that come with the set. Advertisement of the uh, collectible tile, or I mean portrait tile pieces. This is just like the other previous sets that there were. For, for that. And then also. And also, it would have been nice if the names of the characters were underneath the, like the previous ones. Well, since I'm not going to mention any in this uh, video, but yeah. And then, also, build the most detailed Hogwarts castle. Which, if you get both this, and also the Hogwarts Owlery, which I'll do a review on as soon as I can get that. And probably give a little hint for the later uh, Hogwarts section sets there will be. And then the last building steps to there. <clears throat> and now on to the mini it's included in this set. So first up, we would have. Harry Potter, Hermione Granger, and Neville Longbomb, and Dean Thomas. But all of which in the little face prints and hair pieces, same as they've been in previous sets, but also as, as for the torso printing, all of which the same, but of course different hand piece for Dean Thomas, of course. And also not at all any uh, Gryffindor or Slytherin symbols, since obviously they at the point of this set is in Sorcerer's Stone, which is of which when they were first years for that, so I have yet to be sorted. But yeah. And also, nice touch for Hermione here, which is a triple molded leg pieces and the mini skirt piece that we've seen in the Trolls 2 line in 2020, but also used on other Hermione's as well. But yeah. And the next of which is Professor McGonagall. Which with the quite nice torso print and leg printing, and which I think might be the same as in previous sets. I'm not. I kind of forget that. But also some nice arm printing, I mean, which nice to see there. And a tile piece with the listing of students that there are, and in case in this case, the four other figs of this set, and the witch hat of which also same as previous ones, but. Or maybe all new for this, I'm not sure, but yeah. Then on the back side of each of them, all of which same exact back torso printing, and each of which have double sided faces. So, of which most likely the same as from previous sets. And spreading, trying, yeah. Uh, as for this mini fix selection as a whole, I say quite good for how it is, but yeah. 
right next to it, we would have about not one, but two of these little boats here. Of which kind of a simple, simplistic build for how they are, like with just the regular uh, jagged inverted slopes with two different types for that and a couple jumper plates in there and just enough space and of course jumper tiles that is enough space to fit up to around two figs or fit up to two figs in it obviously and then as for the front part of which which has these a uh, cone and sausage pieces, and then a dish piece with a stud on it, with a clip piece to uh, to obviously represent the like front lantern of it. It also do get a couple ore pieces as well for them to paddle along the Black Lake, of course. And that's about it with the two little boats. And now on to the uh, boat house itself. Which, from first glance, kind of similar to most uh, other uh, Hogwarts uh, sections to that, but at least with some unique builds, but at least a different part of it, well, kind of the arriving kind of section of it, which we haven't gotten before, but finally here. So, as for the uh, plates that it stands on, as you see, quite a few. Uh, uh, wedge and curve kind of plates all in dark blue obviously representing some bit of the black lake for how it is and of course and like uh, some other sets like uh, the chamber secrets great hall set from 2021 still using the uh, other jagged slopes and representing the rocky bits and also a uh, clear blue uh, cheese slopes represent uh, the waves of water coming onto it and then one side, which have a cylinder holding, and also a clip part holding a, a fish piece in bright blue. And then also you have this a little a cap piece representing a little bit of a mushroom there, and also a clip holding in the little bar piece representing a tree with the these fern pieces and a little other cone piece on top representing the top part of the pine tree that it is. And as for this entrance section, done quite good for how it is, and luckily has enough room to fit one boat into, like so. Of which, great to see there. And then as for these uh, front sections, do you have uh, two sides of which, with enough plates to stand figs on to. Same with inside of, that, of it as well. And also the classic castle window. Uh, kind of pieces there and a couple of clips with these little bits holding torches to them and then the little nice thing about this set is quite symmetrical uh, for that like this one side which have a couple archway kind of pieces and just bricks stacked on bricks with very little snot to that well in this case used to hold this uh, leaf piece and also a tile piece onto there then other side of which also the same with that but instead of a leaf piece well a leaf piece and also a, a black spider piece most likely representing the uh, other spiders that are some by led by Aragog and giving a little hint for chamber secrets of course then on the back side of which quite vacant hollow space for that with a couple of these uh, bull horn pieces on both sides for that, and then down below of which are a couple of great clip pieces that don't clip to anything, but but most likely could like clip onto a another Hogwarts expansion set coming like either later in the year or next year or 2026. Well, most likely the new section of it that or new arrangements that will go on until 2026. Thanks, but yeah. Then as for this other side, which just still more jagged slopes going on, and also a red crap piece, nice to see there, which don't see very much in LEGO. But yeah. 
and also have this uh, same green part you can like pull right out and just kind of a random section holding a little frog piece into it so kind of random how that is but whatever and then a couple railing part of it and a white owl piece of which not sure if it's supposed to be Hedwig or just some random owl. I'm going to say some random owl. And then as for the uh, upper part of which, let's see the roof part of which, which is in darkish gray, just like the uh, Hogwarts exp uh, system sets from well, from 2018 through 20 kind of had, so it can kind of blend in with that. And a random leaf piece. Onto there. And then the other side was just three random leaf pieces representing moss on top of it. And then, and of course, both of which go up into this curve way. And then as for this top section, representing a mini bell tower to it, which has some good snot going on around with the long curved cheese slopes and classic castle window pieces and a couple cylinder pieces on top. And then on the very top, which does have this uh, little gold weather vane, or gold couple gold cone and various bits, most likely to be a weather vane. And also, as for inside of this uh, bell tower, which has see that little tan piece there, and like pull this out, and do you get one of the uh, new portrait tile pieces? which instead of being on a traditional tile, it's actually on a Nexonite's shield piece. So good thing, good bit to change that up a bit. And uh, not sure which character this is, but whatever. But also to note that this which came in my copy of it, but I'm sure yours could be different. Okay. You can slip it right in like so. And give a view of it from the front. See a little bit of it, bit of it, but yeah. And so now on to the final verdict on this set is Overall, I think this is which a, a kind of good set for how it is. Like for the uh, thirty-eight dollars that it is, well, thirty-five would have been fair enough, or at least thirty, of which could have been better for that, but still kind of a little bit unfair for that. But otherwise, I think still kind of about almost as good as the uh, the Tri Wizard Black Lake set from last year. Even though that set of which was a complete remake, this of which an all brand new one for that, so almost as good as that, but and also like that set, about five good figs for how it is, even though this being their first years, the first the first year appearance of most of our main characters, but yeah. And also and what could be nice is if there was an extra set of that was just the boats and also Included extra figs for like Hagrid, Ron, and uh, Drake, and Draco Malfoy, and so on. But as is still quite good for how it is. But yeah, like, and of course, and also the great rooftops, which can kind of work with the 2018 through 20 uh, Hogwarts sets, of which, and, and unless if you have modded them with some sand green and fit in with the current with the 2021 through 23 styling, but whatever. But, but as is, still quite good for how it is. And all of the back clip parts give do give a little hint for a new style of it, which will probably go on until 2026, but yeah. But yeah. And so now, if you're looking to get this set for your Harry Potter display and collection, definitely get this set. And if you are looking for something new to add in to your uh, Hopworks uh, layout and display, also definitely pick this up. And that is about it with this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.